What's up Instagram? Chances are if you are watching this video you have seen this truck before. This truck is my 2001 Dodge Dakota. It is going to the Tona Truck Meet 2020 alongside with my Black Cummins. It will have a completely different paint scheme on it and I'm letting you guys choose what I'm putting on this truck. I got three paint schemes on my series right now. Three hundred and eight. Three hundred and eight subscribers. Well, guys, a couple days ago, I posted a uh, Instagram video on my Instagram about painting this truck, and that is going to Daytona, Florida. Yeah, I'm taking my black Cummins, and that's a, a whole separate issue by itself. But we got a huge project here ready to go. It's about Daytona is about six days away until we leave. And this truck has to be a completely different color. And you guys chose this paint scheme right there. So right now we are going to get this thing already prepped, ready to go for Daytona for a 1,200 mile round, or what is it? 2,400 mile round trip with this thing on a trailer. It has no business whatsoever being in Daytona. And the whole purpose of this is to paint criminal diesel right on the side, subscribe, whatever, whatever needs to be on there. And the whole point of this is, is more along the lines of a marketing ad, whatever you want to call it. Uh, join the burnout competition and use this thing to get the channel some activity. So how you see it right now, it won't stay this way for long. Uh, tonight will be the first night of building this thing into whatever you guys see at Daytona. Uh, we are going to get uh, paint, sandpaper, a whole bunch of stuff, a couple hundred dollars worth of stuff and get this thing prepped ready to go. So, so we are gonna go do that and I will see you guys tomorrow when we have all the stuff and start sanding this thing down. This guy is looking extremely unhappy right now. Holy shit. All right. Copy that, brother. Oh yeah. I gotta sand down a truck tonight in this shit. All right, guys, the rain actually didn't last that long. You, you guys just saw it downpour, and it actually just rained for like five, 10 minutes or so. It is sprinkling a little bit, but that's not gonna interfere with what we're doing today. We got the Dakota, it's been sitting out. I actually filmed that last clip last night that you guys just saw me describing everything. But we have five days to get this thing on a trailer. I think five days, yeah, five days to get this thing on a trailer and on its way to Daytona, Florida for a mass burnout competition. I didn't thank all you guys yesterday about everything, like the whole Instagram post or whatever, deciding on what I should paint this truck. I actually wanted to do number one. I wanted to do paint scheme number one, which is this one right here. And you guys ended up choosing this one, which is fine. It's it's like my least favorite out of the three that I put up. And it was like, it's like, it's gonna be pretty damn hard to do. But nonetheless, we're gonna do it for you guys. And there's a bunch of people on here that, that will have their names on the truck. So we're gonna put your, your guys' Instagram tags on the truck here in the, probably two or three days after we hood stack it. Yeah, it's getting hood stacked. I can't wait to get it done it's gonna be a pain in the ass. It's gonna be a long next couple five days. So we're gonna get this going here. We gotta sand the truck down tonight and uh, possibly mask off the windows, not guaranteeing that, but at least sand it down and get it ready for some paint tomorrow. So I'm gonna set everything up, got a lot of stuff to do, and let's get rolling. And honestly guys, the, the worst part about doing all this, fire hazard sticker has to go. Had a good run, cool while it lasted. Fire hazard, bro. Thank you, sticker. I like it. Fire hazard. Bump the hard horse. Hopefully it comes off in one piece and uh, maybe we'll uh, incorporate one later on in the Dakota's life, but for now, he's a goner.
So we're gonna be using 80 grit sandpaper. Not sure if this is exactly what you need to do for this type of type of job, but that's what we're gonna be using and hopefully it works. Like Not the right place for this mask, but uh, eight o'clock. I've been working at this thing probably for 30 minutes now. Half the truck sanded down, another half hour, four or five minutes or so. To be uh, ready for some tape. Actually, you know, I got I gotta wash it first. So we'll uh, we'll hopefully get out the power washer later tonight, get her cleaned up, so I can mask it off and start painting them off. All right, guys, it's actually starting to get pretty dark here really quick. The sun went down behind the mountains there. So we got most of the truck done on that side. We have uh, the driver's side door back left to do. Uh, it should only take about 20 or so minutes, if that. My hands are, whew, my hands do not feel good from that vibration. But we don't have too much left. I'm gonna try and get as much on camera for you guys as possible, obviously. Quality might go down, just a fair warning. Just holding tight until we uh, see tomorrow. Alright guys, so even if the frame rate will even allow you to see me, the truck is done. It's about, I think it's about 9 o'clock at night right now. I'm not too late, but I do have to get up early as hell for work in the morning, so it is pretty late for me. Anyway, the truck is done, sanded down, done, washed, and tomorrow we will start masking like I've already told you guys. If I seem a little bit low on energy right now, it's because I am. A lot of work, a lot of work left, a lot of work left. Well, we got hood stacks going on Friday and Saturday this week. It's, you guys will probably already seen this video by the time it's done, but we got to get tires swapped around, loaded up, painted, masked off to put the, all the uh, criminal diesel uh, logos on it and everything. So a lot more left to do go or a lot, lot more left to do uh, my black cummins is right about there if you can see it the uh we're going to get the rear bumper on friday to get that put back on and get that finished up and uh, i will see you guys tomorrow just uh one second hold on <laughs>